Good evening, abductees. It's me, a nasty woman, aka Paul. Um, and we're here for something new. It's finally not Star Wars Jedi Survivor. Um, I'm very happy about that. I mean, not that I didn't like Star Wars, but I think it's time for something different. I was definitely kind of ready for that to be over and for us to kind of move on with something completely new. Um, I'm really excited about this. I, you know, I've heard a little bit of uh, negative chatter, but like, whatever, that's what we're here for. Grey Hill Incident just dropped today. Um, if you don't know anything about it, it's a survival horror kind of takes place in the 90s. UFO, as you can see. I mean, just hearing this music already, you can tell where they're drawing the inspirations from. It's clear that they're drawing some inspiration from signs. You know, it's the 90s, so X-Files, um, all of which is very much my bag. Um, aliens, science fiction, the 90s, very much my childhood. I was a kid who grew up on things like Independence Day, Fire in the Sky, X-Files, loved signs. Um, so this is 115,000% my bag. So I'm pretty excited. Um, let's get into it. Somebody cut Mr. Howard a check. This is an absolutely deeply inspired Guys, story. Guys, can you hear me? My husband said he spotted someone or something next to our car again. I know this sounds weird, but he said it looked like an alien. But they ran into the cornfields and disappeared. I'm going to call the police. Amy, don't. I don't trust the cops or the government, or anyone else for that matter. And you shouldn't trust them either. We created our neighborhood watch for this exact reason. Brandon, I understand the situation, but this needs to stop. It's also absolutely irresponsible to send Ryan out tonight. Amy, don't tell the officials anything. Otherwise, we all end up in the nut house. Are you trying to tell them we think there's little green men running around? Gray, Brandon. <laughs> they are gray. The only thing we can do in our situation is yeah, board up our windows and doors. I'll try to rest a bit. Uh, but Amy... Trust me, you don't want to end up in the psych ward. I paid a high price to break free. Uh, the only oh. way to escape ah, was to... You've told your stupid story a thousand times. In Vietnam, we dealt with things worse than that almost every day. What does Vietnam have to do with it? Whatever. <sighs> a lot I of undiagnosed mental illness going I on. I leave my camper van. I believe the aliens have the ability to control us through telepathic powers. I'm convinced hat protects me. Hey, guys. Henry's been acting strange since he came home from the forest this morning. I don't know what's going on with him. Ryan! From the forest? Is he a hey, Jedi? My kitty cat's also behaving really strangely. Like, who would word it she like that? Come home, yet. come home from the Please, forest? Look for her during your shift. I'm really lonely without her. Uh, Henry is more important right now. But if I find your cat, I'll let you know, Bob. Poor Bob. All right, I'll reach out the to the other neighbors. More important. I'll tell Let's them to board honest. up all their stuff. The fact is, our government is hiding something from the people. Things like this just don't happen here in Grey Hill. It started with Roswell, Cats and it's been civilians. increasing since the 60s. That is the way it is. Are you and your bat ready for the night shift? Ryan Baker, the king of baseball. Yeah, Brandon. I am. Voiced by Joaquin Phoenix. Don't forget to visit us later, Ryan. We'll make some coffee for you. We'll even stir in a little Thorazine. Yeah. Sure. Thanks, Amy. You're gonna need it. <laughs> That's back when QAnon used walkie-talkies. Oh, baby, they got that sensitivity up on, like, 1,500. 
Oh, and you can't navigate the menus of the controller. Okay. Settings. Gameplay. Sensitivity. Let's, let's turn that bitch down. Down. Okay, it's a little more. Oh, what is this called? Um, communion, right? It's absolutely a book with this same cover. The double one controversial New York bestseller by James Freeman. This is my story. I explain everything about what I experienced during my alien abduction. Plain spoken, that James Freeman. The fuck do we open this? And the physics on this fucker is like... Can we open it? I bought this book back in the 80s. My brother Bob experienced something similar during his childhood. So Bob is his brother. No wonder he's not calling the white coats right now. Okay, left click. Hey, Ninja. Thanks for joining. Oh, look, it's one of those uh, hospital urinal things. And it doubles as a hand crank flashlight. Piss into it. A piss-fueled flashlight. Brandon bought several of these flashlights from... Brandon brought brought several of these flashlights from Vietnam. We're using them because the others have problems at night. I think, yeah, like, they don't have batteries. And I'm like, what do you mean they don't work at night? I think they work because of the crank function. However, the dy dynamo doesn't work. The dynamo. Yeah, this joint's falling apart. That Civil War. AP. What does that mean? <laughs> Piss fuel flashlight was my nickname in Scouts. Um, I would probably go to the police and let them know who your scoutmaster was. There's probably some charges to press. Yeah, we're going to touch this later on and turn around and realize that the last time there was an eclipse was 22 years ago. Then Vin Diesel's going to show up. Rubik's Cube. The, the neighbor the neighborhood is communicating via walkie-talkie most of the time it, you know it kind of does feel like it's for VR but interestingly enough it's it's not I don't think there was any chatter about old guys in the hood calendar yeah it's looking a little uh a little light on the melanin to be talking about old guys in the hood. Let's reassess, y'all. Let's reassess. <laughs> Starfinder. I need to know what AP is. Like, artificial person? What are we talking about here? Death Chord, Man and His Woman, Temple of the Chosen, How to Grow Super Trees, hey, novels, Ross Schiller, OMG, did you know the names of the Lost Ones? Gruesome Men, it could be Alien Person. Why are they faced away? Eyes wide open. Can we crouch? Is crouching a thing in this game? Oh, we've got one! We're holding on to a piss fuel flashlight. 
Is there no crouch? Hold on. There's gotta be a crouch. Okay. Well, I gotta be a, I gotta be real with y'all. That's not crouching at all. <laughs> if you can believe it, it's not crouching. All right, let's get the fuck out of this bedroom. I was like, I was gonna open up or what? God damn it! He still hasn't fixed the TV. Stop complaining about me. I can hear you. God. I shouldn't do that now. Oh, I shouldn't? What's happening in this image? What is that? Anyway. <laughs> I shouldn't do that now. We really shouldn't. Losing time. Matt. M oh, excuse me, Mutt Danger, international bestseller, Mutt Danger. All those who became abducted by the Greys shared the same story. People who claim to have been abducted by aliens often report they lost time. Yeah, that's happening right now. Henry, tell me what you saw in the forest today. Rachel, that crazy girl. Henry, there's someone in your room. Is Rachel in there? God, I hope not. She should stop bothering me. What's going on with you, Henry? Tell me. We just stumbled into some family Who's drama. There? I'm going to your room, Henry. Stay here. He doesn't seem bothered by it. Henry, is Rachel real? Is that girl in your mind bothering you again? And he seems pretty chill about whatever the fuck's going on because he's just sitting here watching snow, sipping his Dr. Thunder, or whatever fucking store brand pop he's drinking. I shouldn't do that now. You just said that somebody might be in his room and we need to check it out, so maybe we should do that now. Someone was in your room. They went out the window. Based on, oh, we didn't even get over there. Max is so he's reading Brazilian science magazines. This family is weird. Why is the kitchen this tiny room that's behind a closed door it's really kind of smaller than a bedroom? That young six burner stove in the bedroom kitchen with the curtains. And the dog that barks on a loop, Borf, Borf. <sighs> Henry, never should have kidnapped you from that gas station. The internet doesn't do that. <laughs> Sorry to let you know this. <laughs> The internet don't do that. Okay, but for real, how do we crouch? Washing powder. Yeah, we need a lot of washing powder. Where is this damn dog? I see him out the window. 
Um, well, I hate this house. Uh, I would immediately stop paying the mortgage. Because it's really awful. The layout is miserable. Max, stop barking! Who's there? Hey. Who? Oh! <laughs> no. something to break this door. Find something to break the door. I, I genuinely don't know like what kind of life we walked in on here, but the community is talking via walkie-talkie. The dogs out here barking like crazy. It's not a good time. Real talk, the controller support is very weird for this. Um, which I find interesting simply because this is about to release on console very soon, like within the next week or so. Okay, that was... Fascinating. Some more washing powder. Rabbit jars. Soy sauce. Beer. I mean, like, we've got enough beer to... I don't know. Yeah. Oh! Clicking now. No, Max! We're locked out, now we're locked in. We busted this door once. Nothing was making sense. God, that thing goes dead fast. Okay. Oh, but now it's open? Okay. <laughs> yeah. Max! Stay here! I'm starting to see it. Max! 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 This is it. Sounds like the neighbors are boarding up their windows. I guess I should do the same. This Sorry. thing really just... Man. Look how fast no, that just goes out. It. You're gonna need more life? piss, kid. I, I've... So, you have to press the left, um... The left stick to instigate, like, a run. But it stops the second you stop pressing down on it. Uh, asinine. Uh, very flawed. Dad, it wasn't Rachel, right? Yeah, he uh, locked the door and ran out of the roof. It's okay. Yeah, it wasn't it's Rachel. Out. It was a strange light. Look, the TV. It's <laughs> working now. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Lunatics and conspiracy theorists claim to have seen a UFO. It's the like they're talking right to us. That the small green aliens are real. The government has checked into this incident and has announced that this UFO, fortunately, is just a weather balloon. This movement that you'll see in a few seconds is just a reflection on the lens of the camera. 
there is no reason to concern. And don't forget to be aware of the small green man in your backyard. Your Mr. Broker. And then it immediately stops working. That is not a weather balloon. They're lying. The government is lying and they're trying to hide it from us. Brandon was right. They're already in Grey Hill. We can't talk about it to the police. They'll just lock us up in a psych ward. Dad, we need to get out of this cursed place. I hate this neighborhood hole. Ryan, this neighborhood hole? Who's the neighborhood hole? Am I the neighborhood hole? I can be the neighborhood hole. How do I answer the walkie talkie? <coughs> Neighborhood hole here, over. The, we just came into this situation and everything's like on 11 for no reason. Henry, go to your room and hang out with Rachel. It's an alien invasion because the dog's barking and there was some weird lights in the yard. How do I answer this fucking walkie talkie? I'm pressing buttons y'all and we're not walking or talking. I literally have no idea how to answer this fucking. They didn't like optimize any of these controls. Like settings. Okay, it literally None of this lines up. The flashlight is triangle. Um. Move, crouch? Absolutely not. It moves, but it does not crouch. Sprint is the left. Like, that's why I'm like, what are you talking about? Like, I can't even exit this menu. The fucking controller, even though I can get into it. Oh, th there we go. The button that it says is the walkie-talkie is absolutely not the walkie-talkie. What is the configuration here? This is super fucking weird. Oh, hold on. How do we... Cause this is, this is honestly a shit show. Okay, take it to your room. Okay, I'm also not reading, but like... I shouldn't do that now. Whose room is... Th this is the kid's room. <laughs> uh, okay. I'm here. Why didn't we just take Ryan, the walkie-talkie to begin Joe with? Barson, the farmer, you know? He called me a few minutes ago. He was very afraid. Then the radio connection became broken off by something. He is working on the field near your house. You must check immediately what happened to him. Yeah, it was broken off okay. because he left I'll the room and left without the walkie-talkie. Right Someone was in Henry's room. They escaped out the window. I almost caught them in our shed. But there was a strange blue light. I'm sure you have no go. evidence have of any of that. No one will help us. We're all boarding up our windows currently. 
I know how to shoot because of the Vietnam War, and you can handle the baseball bat. We will overcome this night and drive to our holiday I... home by tomorrow. <laughs> Don't forget how I shot your son's hat off while wearing it when I was drunk at the barbecue last well, summer. Granton, Imagine how you I can still have to pay for that. Sober. <sighs> but leaving town tomorrow sounds like a good idea. I think these people have all already been abducted and experimented on deeply. This is like, these are the old truck. Like, the, <laughs> these whores have had <laughs> the probes up their ass, probes in their eyeballs, in their tear ducts, in their urethras, the ear canal. They've been probed on every fucking level, and they're just... Zip, zap, zooped, and zopped. <laughs> These bitches are done. Because they just can't do English. Uh, and I know how to shoot because of the Vietnam War and no other reason. There are no other reasons that I know how to shoot. And I will not stand for you suggesting otherwise. Or I might shoot your son's hat off his head again. And you have to pay for... He told him you have to still have to pay for that. Pay for what? The hat? Or like the emotional toll of having traumatized you and your son that you absolutely kidnapped from a gas station. This kid ain't never been right. They were headed to Mall of America, and this dude just said, Yoink, got a kid now. <sighs> what? Okay, pl I need an architect. Like, I need to do a playthrough, like, where I'm sitting with an architect uh, to really kind of explain the flow of this house. Explain to me why the kitchen is a bedroom that's closed away. Why this weird little passageway has the bathroom. Um... make any of this make sense yeah the, the fucking across the street is haunted what what's that nothing <laughs> I'm prepared to call my local senator about this fucking game because this this excuse me Hello, the police? Uh, what was that? We don't have cell phones. Or was that the thing that they replaced the cow with after they abducted it and hoped that we wouldn't... Okay, well, X still operates in a semi-similar fashion. Woodbreaker by Joe Parson. Is this a story written in wood and iron? By Joe Parson. I think this was written by ChatGPT, honestly. Truly? Joe Parsons sold me this ax last year because we just couldn't go down to the Ace Hardware, the true value, and get a, an ax. We had to get one with a story. We had to hire Joe Parsons to build us this ax. He said it can chop with three times faster. I think it was a... Chat GP I'm telling you, Chat GPT wrote this game. That ju there's just no reason for how ridiculous any of this is.
Wow. Okay, so I was warned. Well, well, we live right on the, the town limit. Can we, like, get in? Can we get in? Maybe Can we do that? Mm, maybe. Uh-oh. Sure, that's a, a, a door. Let's close it. Or not. Or leave it on. Let's close it or leave it open. Girl. Same. What is good? No. I don't think so. These cows got the Uncle Frank treatment. Damn it. Nothing works. That's real, uh, a lot. Oh, wow. Damn. I mean, but at least they left the meat. We might still get some burgers out of that. Mel Gibson, you in here? Sounded less terrified and a little bit more aroused. Sounded like he was almost there. I honestly I think it's the townspeople more What the is this Bob's cat? The cat uh, not anymore. And it looks like Kitty. I should bring her to his caravan. This is the best thing that's happened so far, is coming across this cat. I, I mean, honestly, anything could be a door, so... Pardon, a gate. We're using that term very loosely. Bob already boarded up his door weeks ago. It's me, the neighborhood hole. Try the dormer window on his roof. Oh man, the way I thought, the way I thought this said Bob Barker, and I'm like, uh, the price is right. But from the way this is going, twenty four ninety nine, the price was not right. This that was a little too much for this game because this is a clown show. Yeah, he's seen in the fourth dimension with these little probes he's got on him. Bob Barker file. Claims to become abducted by gray aliens when he was a child. According to him, the statement they made experiments... According to him, the statement they made experiments on him and impl... Who wrote this? 
made experiments on him and implemented a probe which he ripped out later. Out of where? Three words to describe him are lunatic, foolish, and dangerous. Bob has stolen this from psychiatry? Did they? Is this real time? Re are you doing real time research? Because I could believe it, man. Just the grammatical bullshit alone makes me want to sue this company that developed and is distributing this game. Because I'm just like. Homie ain't no way. Y'all let this go. Like this. This is looser than my neighborhood hole. Oh, oh, we just walk into it. The controls, there's no consistency. What, what kind of shoes are we wearing? Oh, look at these. Look at these. It, I think it's supposed to look like denim, but like the texture makes it look more like corduroy. <laughs> Fuck. That's so unfortunate because this is 100%, 100% like my kind of thing. Aliens, the 90s, mystery, horror, like, this is what I'm here for. We're just breaking in. Okay, how do I get down? Oh, I've, I probably got a crouch, which cannot be done through the controller. It literally, I'm, I have to hit this on the keyboard. Um, yeah. I might be asking for a refund too. Super disappointing. Okay, this place isn't that big, so like, where is he hiding? They abducted me. Fuck the government. Just the, the controls on this, trying to spin this book around, feels like trying to unearth the mystery of existence. Bob Baker tells the story about his abduction, describes how to have a happy live. How to, how to have a happy live. Yeah, I saw they did an update. So, like... Two or three hours ago, I noticed that there was, um, they tweeted out, like, oh, there's a, an update. I think talking about that, we added more lights and, <laughs> and shit. And, like, I had to download their little 200 megabyte update. Describes how to have a happy live despite being probed. This absolutely was written by ChatGPT. But also, I don't even believe that because I don't think ChatGPT would have made that many, like, spelling and grammatical errors. Subwater, directed by Keys Cameron. Is that supposed to be, like, the abyss? Movie of the year. Oh, that was... That was a that was an achievement picking up that VHS. Oh! Ryan, I thought that was you on my roof. <gasps> <laughs> my cats? Jesus yeah, fuck me Christ. Out in the field near the tractor. Oh, what does she have on her head? I don't know. It makes a strange noise. It sounds like electricity or something. Oh, and Bob, I had a strange encounter in my backyard. There was also some kind of weird electricity. I'll tell you about it later. Let's look at the cap. Put her on the table. I'll take a closer look. Put her on the... Where?
Oh, that's the table. Mm. It looks like an implant or some kind of probe. Ryan, I think they abducted Kitty. They had experiments. By the way, have you boarded up your house? It's really dangerous in Greyhound these days. No, not yet. You should do it immediately. You need to wear a tinfoil hat. Your son Henry too. They go into your brains by telepathy. Also, don't forget, don't ever tell anything to the police. As Brandon said before, the government knows it. Now, take this preparation for your walkie-talkie. The tinfoil's on the kitchen desk. I... Hmm. I'm genuinely questioning if I should just turn this off and get a refund. Because, like, I, I cannot imagine that this is going to get better. Um, and I'm just taking issue with, like, the mechanics, like, literally the controls. This controller doesn't even do all of the things that it claims that it does. Like, this is absolutely not true, any of this. Well, except for move and look around. And pause. And maybe interact. And that's about it. Ryan, please check the monitors! Huh? Yes. What the hell is this? You don't look that upset, fam. Achievement is called. They're here. Yeah. Don't go the street. Go through the barn in front of my caravan. I've got a camera. I'm gonna record the UFO. This will be the perfect complement for my documentation. And then I'm coming over. Break down the door with your baseball bat and take care. Ma'am. Okay, can I leave? Or is this the door that I'm breaking down with a baseball bat? What? How do I leave? Excuse me. Oh, okay. Um, oh, okay. Okay, genuinely, how do we get out of here? I'm just like pressing buttons. I thought he said something about breaking down the door with the baseball bat. But what? what's the button for the... Like, holy shit. Hit, break, shoot. Break the door with your baseball bat. Okay. 
Well, we got it, y'all. Any shit happening? I saw you gotta use the mouse, the keyboard, and the controller. Okay. Henry, can you hear That's me? That's fucking nonsense. That, yeah, that's genuine garbage, because, like... Hit, break, shoot. Is a trigger button. One of these trigger buttons, and there absolutely does not work. Okay, guess we gotta stop with the controllers to duck. Sure. Like you do, and then you fall down. <laughs> oh, wow. Holy shit. Shouldn't go that way. All right. Is this not our house? <laughs> okay. Oh, well, he's getting tired? I think I'm going in the wrong direction. Okay, but I got. What? Should I stop and let this dude catch his breath? I swear I'm not stupid. Like, I shouldn't go. What do you mean I shouldn't go? I can't run anymore. Like, this is as fast as we can go. Okay. <sighs> I think he had Alzheimer's by Joe Parson. That was an achievement. I can see where they went wrong because they believed that <laughs> the Jimmy Crack Corn ass minimum was a fucking achievement. Uh, can we leave?
Oh, this is... When I tell you this is beyond weird and like... Utterly nonsensical. Okay, yeah, gotta use the mouse again. Yeah, because of course you do. Uh, do we have to crouch again? Yeah, cool. Back to the keyboard again. Now we're back to the controller. Are you getting all this, kid? <laughs> I think I remember there being a fence through the cornfield. I just need to get around the side of the That's cool. But the rest of this? A joke. Uh, no! Jump over no, the fence! Oh, his son that he kidnapped is getting re kidnapped. It's the neighborhood son. Whenever you need a son for an event or someone to pose as your son, just kidnap the kid. Jesus on a wheel. Okay, so he's gone. Family shattered. I'm sure I just missed something that was supposed to be cool. Can we at least play like a mini game? Like. No, hold on. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. It lasts roughly ten seconds. Let's go through the bathroom to get out of the house. I know. Uh. This dude is slow. Isn't this the barn that we just came... Like, why did we have to go all the way around to get... Because, like... Do you see what I'm saying? How does that make sense? That's the trailer. We broke it down. The house is right there. Why couldn't we have just gone right there? Why did we have to go through this now-closed barn to get back to the house? They just wanted to give us a reason to go through the corn. Uh, mm. Oh no, they're gone. Top secret, because why would local police have a file marked top secret? What state is this? It's gotta be like some place like fucking Nebraska or Arkansas or something awful like that. 
Okay, so do we not get into the car or deal with the car? It just crashed and we're supposed to be like, holy shit, they crashed. Damn, that's crazy. I, I don't know, and I'm not gonna stand there and try and fuck with that. Whatever. Baby boy is gone. Open what door? For the police car? Didn't work. Here? Pressing every button. Are you talking about this barn? Because this barn is where we came through to begin with to go through the corn so that we could say that we went through the corn. And if you mean this, this is where I went to initially, but it's all boarded up, like. I guess let's go back by the cows. Yeah, this is. Um, cut the shit. This was a door two minutes ago. This is literally the way we, that we came in. So this game is just doing things to keep you from doing things that it doesn't Maybe I should turn around. want you to do. Okay, then... Get to the squad... Get to the squad car? What the fuck are you talking about? We already did that. Oh, I am asking for a refund for this game. Like, I don't want to cut the stream, but like, this is so fucking convoluted. Why is he tired now? Hitting every button. Yeah, I've shit, I have zero fucking idea. Are we supposed to crouch? Oh, oh this is gonna annoy me if this works. I'm almost equally annoyed that it doesn't work. And, and like, it's super inconsistent with... Is that little reticle? Is that little reticle, is that the, the running? These, uh, you can probably barely see it where you are but around the the aiming reticle you see how there's like that circle that's like slowly filling up is that the run meter this game is fucking unreal bad i almost can't even believe this was released I'd, I'd love to know 
what made them think that everyone's inclination, everyone's first instinct would be to walk through the branches of the tree to get into the fucking vehicle and not breaking the window or entering the passenger seat where the fucking thing is the the top secret file that these boo-boo podunk ass local heroes would have in their possession a top secret file because you know small town state police just have that shit I gotta say, of all of the ways in which this game is, like, an offense to the, the craft of, of making games, probably the thing that has sent me over the edge, that has solidified me absolutely going to them for a refund, is what just happened. Is them trying to ask me... <laughs> It's them trying to to imply that uh, I was wrong for going for the most logical way into this car. No, it's a puzzle game. You gotta think about it, man. You gotta use the least likely entrance into this vehicle, and that's that's the way in. That's the puzzle. How did I hear about this game? Um... Yeah, right? Let's no clip through trees, man. We're taking a quick road no clip trip through through the branches into this squad car. Uh I heard about it um I I think I watched like some video like upcoming horror video games in 2023 a while back and I and I saw that it was coming out and they had much of the footage that was in the little trailer um kind of ready to go and uh yeah it it looked like it was gonna be a good time um and then since then i've seen a bit of promotional material for it like on facebook on twitter um yeah i was very excited about this um because i thought even if it's like I'm here thinking, okay, maybe the story's gonna be kind of, mm, you know, but there'll be some some fun scares or it'll be goofy, you know. I I didn't imagine that the the mechanics were gonna be such shit. And to be honest, it, what really is kind of sending me off is the fact that. This game is, like, days away from being released on consoles. It's going to be on Xbox and PlayStation 5 and maybe 4. I don't know. One of them. Or both. Um, yet, the controller support isn't here. But it shows it as though it has full controller support. Like... It shows you what it's supposed to be. It is not that. Those don't happen. Um, it's, it's weird. This is big weird. And it's too bad because actually, like, aesthetically, they did a really good job. Like, atmosphere is top notch. Like, it looks good. The music was good. The little menu like I, they were hitting the john blah 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 whatever howard the composer for signs they're hitting those notes sounded just like that um the corn the ufos like creep factor was there but this is like i i can't even get to the point where we're dealing with the aliens because this is just so bad because i'm literally it, it would have been one thing if literally the only thing that I couldn't do with the controller was the crouch, which is bad enough, considering that it says right there that I should be able to crouch with the controller. But the fact that I then had to utilize 
the mouse also. So I'm using three different... At that point, I might as well just do this mouse and keyboard. But I'm a, a, a bit of a fucking philistine. I don't, I don't enjoy keyboard, mouse. Mostly because my fucking hands fall asleep. Like, I don't know. Anyway... Well, there were no reviews this morning, but right before I started this up on, um, let's just get out of this because I'm absolutely asking for a refund. We can look at, um, ah, listen to that music. It's good. Listen to that woodwind. Listen to that piano. It's so good. The music and this, this aesthetic, is the best part about this. I think this this menu is the best part of the game. It sets up the vibe. Yeah, so let's see. Store page. I wonder, too, if it's just unfinished, because, like... And, that, and that's been an issue plaguing games, period, lately. Like, it doesn't want to even, it doesn't even fucking want to load the, the, <laughs> doesn't even want to load the page. No, no, help me! Lunatic section. Yeah, that is rough. Uh, it is in your Steam library. Mostly negative out of 139. This is in line with what you were saying, Aerith. Um, update. I, I, I love that. If you're a sucker for late alien... Okay. Mostly negative. The horrible. Run for five seconds. Catch your breath for 90 seconds. <laughs> Turn volume up because you can't hear the voices. Jump scare blast your speakers into tiny pieces. Game is a chore simulator and they all take 20 minutes because you move so slowly. The game is $25. Too expensive. Very short. Only takes long because of run speed. The good. Maybe they will patch the game. I would rather, I'm guessing shit, I would rather shit in my hands and eat it than have to play this game ever again. Extremely dull, no map or waypoints. They basically expect you to know exactly where to go at all times using cryptic hints found in the menu. Graphics suck, voice acting sucks, it's constantly overlapping. Don't buy this unless you really want to throw money away. Definitely not worth the amount they ask for. Product received for free. This is genuinely one of the worst games I've ever played. There is no sense of direction. You're going to be lost 90% of the game. I tolerated this because it felt like it was leading up to something, but then you reach the point where there are tens of tiny aliens waddling around, grabbing you, making you miserable, repetitive and boring. The entire mystery disappears and it just turns into a shooter where you shoot aliens to kill them. But there is barely any bullets, so the game expects you to be stealthy. But because there is literally nothing to look forward to... Okay, and see, that's damning. Because they're talking about stealthy. So I guarantee you that crouch is going to become important. And if I have to constantly jump off of my controller onto the keyboard just to crouch, jumping in and out of crouch, this shit was going to hit the fucking fan and splatter in my face. And I was going to be... Fecally facialed by this game. It was going to be awful. Um, yeah. It's pretty bad. Pretty bad. I had high hopes for this game. Plus, the idea and overall atmosphere is there, but no quest marker, no get into the blah 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 objects uh, that you can interact with, no way to rebind your controls. And then there is the performance. Oh man, I'm way above the recommended specs, and I would not want to be the guy with any lower specs. It's not great. 
I requested a refund for this game. While the concept is interesting, the game feels unfinished. It crashed once. The real issue lies in the lack of objective tracking and vague directions on where to go. Then, at least to me, the smash E to escape from aliens. So, like, these hoes are out here playing this on the keyboard and mouse. I just can't. I'm not a keyboard mouse gamer. I, I can't do it. That's why, like, I see games that are, like, no controller support on Steam, and I'm just like, mm, I, I can't. Like, unless somebody has some real good workarounds, like, to make it comfortable, my fucking shits be falling asleep and getting tingly and shit sitting here doing this. Uh, and I hate that. I hate that sensation. I'm, I'm real sensitive to it. So, mouse and keyboard gaming is, is not it for me. I'm a controller neanderthal i have waited an entire year for this game is it early access i'm not sure why i just can't get it oh, I just... <gasps> when did they write this i'm not sure if i can recommend this game or not i'll just say no for now and update later okay it's... yeah so yeah everyone hates her Gameplay is fun with interesting ideas. There, yeah, that that's that's a masochist. That is absolutely someone who likes to have their nuts stepped on, uh, and to get fisted. They are absolutely into that. Well, you know what? As a treat, let's go ahead and um, you guys can watch me request <laughs> a refund. Let me see, how, how do we get this refund? I keep thinking this says refund. Uh, how do we... Oh, controller layout. Jump. Yeah, there was, there was no jumping. There was no jumping. Sprint. There, no crouch. No crouch. Uh. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. Well, actually, I did it through um, PayPal. I I do the purchases through PayPal. But anyway, oh, I will absolutely. I want to permanently remove this game from my account. Playtime one hour. Okay, cool. Anyway, yeah, I'll do it off. I'll do it off the stream. Um, I, I don't think they will, but just in case. It's been real, y'all. It's, oh, see, it's early. And, like, there's a real part of me that wants to do something else, but I kind of didn't prepare anything else. Oh, I do have that other game, the Blood, what was it, Blood Wash? Whatever, like, Puppet Combo did that laundromat game. But I think I have to set up the the PlayStation to do that. But maybe I'll do that. I'll, I'll see. So I'm going to jump off, request this refund. If I have the energy, I might jump back on. And if for nothing else, even if no one jumps back on with me, I'll still upload it to YouTube and it'll be on Twitch. So anyway, to my friends, thank you so much for jumping on here. Pimp, Aerith, Tyler, thanks. Thanks, guys. Uh, sorry it wasn't better, but I'm not going to let them keep my money for this. So uh, if you're watching this on YouTube later, <laughs> I hope it was good for a laugh because uh, it certainly had me uh, cackling with derision. Um, but yeah, if you like it, if you think it's a good time, you can 
hit that like and subscribe because you love me and uh, you want to see more of this bullshit. And I will thank you and lift the curse that I put on you for not originally subscribing and liking. Um, and I'll see you next time.